What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to New Automatus. I'm very excited today because they just released uh, the patch for Neo Automata, which uh, means we don't need to actually use the mod that I've been linking in the comments, I mean, in the description up until now, because they finally patched it so that it runs at at least 1080p. Uh, there might even be a high-res texture mod. I'm not sure. I need to go check that out, uh, see if they've made that available. Uh, but yeah, the game is looking very, very sharp and I like it. Um, there is some uh issues now with the grass it's looking like very grainy um but i think that's because most modern games have that kind of issue all right we have uh okay i think i'm going to turn down the anti-aliasing just a little bit give me a second yeah sorry about that guys uh but basically we don't need such high anti-aliasing and it was giving us a little bit of lag i don't think there's any like uh crystal clarity that will be gained from it uh so we will uh, i did turn it down just a little bit. I didn't switch it off. Operator to 9S. This is 9S. Go ahead. I've We're listening. I've message for 2B and 9S from the commander. Okay. Initiating playback. You're wanting us to go to speak 9S. to Pascal? We've lost contact with several Yorha units that were on their way to the surface. You need to go to the theme park. So I presume they're still alive. We've tracked the location of their signals. So I need all Yorha units on the surface to head over and investigate. End transmission. Hmm. I heard something about that back at the resistance camp. Target location confirmed. I'm worried about the other androids. We should probably check this out as soon as possible. Agreed. So uh, I, I made uh, to be aggressive. I changed it to that because of the fact that we, we ourselves are not particularly uh, great at combat because we only have one attack. So having nine, uh, having to be run off ahead like that and deal with anybody that's bothering us is really great. Makes things easier for me. Yeah, I love the combat in this game. It's literally addictive. Every time I play anything, I just get, uh, what is this? Oh, right. We now have things on the map to tell us where to find collectibles. Is this a fishing spot here that you're telling us about? Ooh, no, you're telling us about a hidden chest. Whoa. Brilliant. Okay, I'm so glad we put things on the mini map. That's literally gonna make life amazing. Okay, let's... take out these guys <laughs> and uh we're gonna head in the direction of the theme park which i think we need to head off and to the right if i remember correctly there's somewhere we need to go underground oh, the combat in this game is just so addictive oh i love it okay uh, off to the right then. So, uh, I wonder if at any point along this, we're actually going to split off from 2B and perhaps get a slightly different perspective on things would be nice. Just because we, we seldom get an opportunity to really see things from a different perspective. So it'd be nice to get it, I think. Can we charge up this attack? Oh, okay, that's what happens when you charge it up. Nice. Okay. I I can't remember what the combat was like with the robot in the theme park. Like so I'm really looking forward to it. Off. Maybe we can get through from underground. Yeah. No no messing around. Obviously we know this. We've done this before. Uh, but obviously, our main characters don't so know that. Be, those machines out in the desert look just like androids, right? Right. But we androids were modeled after our human creators. So why would machines try to look like us? Hmm. There's no point trying to work out unsolvable problems. I suppose. By the way, I uh, discovered that you can do this. If you're gliding and you attack, <laughs> you can spin kick. 
<laughs> it's it's practically like <laughs> like one of those old-fashioned PlayStation One games. Oh, and you can uh, uppercut, I think. Yeah. <laughs> that is so cool. Look at this. I know. What is it I wanted to do? Hang on. Hang on. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, look at that. What a lovely combo. That is is just brilliant. I love it. Okay, we need to climb out of here. Now, I'm pretty sure somewhere along here there was a secret weapon. Oh, did we go past our objective? Are we about to find the secret weapon that... Wait, hang on. Why is the map telling us we can go further? Ah, it's because the secret weapon is this way. Uh, I'm just going this way in case anything has changed. I doubt it has, but I think it's worth checking. Because you never know. Hello! Creepy... Creepy forest. So the lighting is also way better with this patch. It's It just makes it so much more worth it. Um, the forest genuinely feels creepy now, which I love. Okay, let's let's hop down and head back, and then over through to the theme park. See if we can make a little bit more sense of the story that's going on here, and why all these robots at the theme park were under their control. I love these little extra hidden scenes. Nice Control to meet you. Has been assigned to 2B. This is tactical support unit pod 153. Control has been assigned to 9S. Combat data exchange requested. Exchange accepted. Are we going to get heavy Proposal. attacks? Data should be exchanged regularly for greater efficiency. <laughs> this is so cute. Proposal accepted. Data will be exchanged regularly for greater efficiency. Just copying like exactly what they say. That was it. That was the extra scene. Nothing about like world building or anything like that. Well, okay. A, a little bit disappointing, but um, not horribly so. Uh, but I mean, you know, what else do you expect? We knew when we when we came back for a second playthrough that vast majority of it was likely to be the same, um, but. I suspect that once 9S gets separated and like goes lost, goes missing, that we're going to start to see much, much bigger differences in terms of uh, what we see and uh, don't see in terms of story. So, uh, just I'm now being conscious to pick up all these extra things because we, we need them to like upgrade weapons and such. So, <clears throat> I wasn't doing it earlier because it wasn't easy to look at it and know what's what. But now I can... I actually look at the map and see how many there are and not get kind of overwhelmed. So it helps a lot. Oh, okay. Give us a useful scene. Thank you. <laughs> they were found by the machines. The machines called them. I love this design. Treasures. Each treasure had a different shape. Each treasure had a different shape. What? What does that mean? We saw this before the previous boss battle, and now we're seeing it before the next one. Are they telling us the origin of these machines? We just have to read between the lines. If you guys know or like what are can figure out what it means, let me know. Yo! Wow, this is weird. Hang on, hang on. We don't need to attack uh, 9S. I mean, 2B. Let's... <laughs> Did I... Was that me last time? Uh, wait, no, hang on. Where is it? Okay. I'm going to put you at passive. And you're going to drop out of combat, okay? Promise me? Ah! Don't make me kill this guy. Let him just go back to life. Okay, but I don't want to kill the others. It's literally just because uh, 2B started that. 
Oh, but hang on, you get stuff out of it. Okay, but we're not we're not gonna get involved in that. I'm gonna uh, choose a different style. I thought aggressive would be if you're in combat. Let's just put you at close range. Okay, close range <laughs> sounds good. Don't go attacking robots that will be our friends in the future, please. Let's uh, <laughs> let's be smart about picking our battles, you know. Uh, okay. So all these guys are gonna, uh, we, I think we might have killed them by mistake last time. Uh, do you guys want to talk to us? What's going on? What fun, what fun. Uh, you're not saying anything unusual, except my love. What? <gasps> Shattered earring. Whoa. Okay. So, go to the, the special markers on the map, in that case. Um, what was I going to say? I was... Got mail. Great. I'm pretty sure we've had it before then, haven't we? These are all machines we know. Machine with a dream. We would have to come to you for the other quest uh, involving your first customer. Great draft bracelet. Um, we would have had to come for you for that quest involving Jean All, but he's gone. Um. If we go to the right, that takes us... Does it take us where we want to go? These are good questions. I can't remember what the next step is. I... I think that... Uh, it's kind of luck if you happen to find someone who's got something to give you. These are the family uh, machines again. Just wanting to celebrate together and all that. Surrender to love. Yeah, of course. Sure, can we can we get Adam and Eve to understand that? Would be really great if we could. Uh okay. Let's let's just clear out this area here. And then I, I think we have to hit around the side to get in combat. I believe. I think this is locked. This gate isn't going to open. Yeah, Maybe that's what I thought. Way around. Okay, yeah, because we had that last time. That's why I was pretty sure we had to head around to the side, but I, I thought, okay, going to the side is going to take us to Pascal's village, but I I obviously uh, forgot that we came this way first. So there's a shop here, which we haven't um, made use of yet. Have you got anything useful? Could buy a whole bunch of... Uh... Wow. We have so much money as well. We could do this if we wanted to. Is this stuff I sold? Let's... Whoa. No, it's not. That's what's in my inventory. Those numbers. Okay, let's... Uh... Whoa, okay. That's a bit expensive. <laughs> let's, um... Let's bump it up to... 10 in each case. Just so we can... Use it for crafting. And uh, we'll just leave it at that. Uh, but we will very quickly... Oh, visual cure. I need to... Uh, I forgot that you can use items in combat. So I'm going to want to check that out. Uh, shortly. See what, what items are actually available. I'm looking for anything here that is worth selling. Use this to make your, your odds stronger. Power part S. So, you'll be able to upgrade one of the pods? These are all things that... Oh no, hang on, there we go. Think can be exchanged for money. That's what we wanted. That's why it's great to get those gifts. Sell the mask, why not? Machine core? Look how much that is, guys. 75,000. Wow! Rolling in dough. And then you got all these little extra things. Uh, okay. Let's have a look at these. So we can select items here to use, normally. Um, and then you use them in combat. But uh, I don't know where this thing is for pod, up, uh, pod abilities. Uh, it's not pod abilities. It's that 
that thing that we just saw that would supposedly make our pods stronger. Uh, we, I need to figure out how you use that or if, if that's like a prerequisite item in order to upgrade your pod. It probably is. Usually that's the case with these things where there's one item you need to get. It's almost like the equivalent of a blueprint in some senses. And once you have that, you can do the upgrades. But prior to that, uh, it's blanked out, even if you have the other items. Uh, so it might very well be that. And as soon as we go to one of the... Where does this corridor lead? One of the, the pod places we can upgrade it, we might get information about that. We'll be able to see and test my hypothesis. If you're on a break, just staring into the corner. As we do on breaks. I know, I do that all the time. Don't you? Okay, these guys are still pretty harmless. Just wandering around. It'll be good to see them uh, liberated <laughs> after all of this. We're getting resistance signals from that building over there. Ah, there's the castle in the background. Wow, it's amazing how now I kind of know my way around the map and what a difference that makes. All right, let's check the email that we got. Supply trader, new products in stock. Thank you for your continued support. We received a new, ship, uh, new shipment of plug-in chips today, as well as other superb items that we would love for the fine members of Yohai to test. All right. And as thanks to your many years of kind patronage, we've made them available for a special price. Please pay us a visit when you can, and feel free to bring your friends. Okay, so we need to go to Resistance Camp in order to uh, check out those plug-in chips. That'll be useful. There might be some really nice ones there. Uh, operator 210. I think that is the operator for 9S. Uh, regular verification. This is scheduled correspondence for your home members. If you have an issue, please respond. Even if you do not have an issue, we would not particularly mind if you sent a response. As it is possible, we might be able to use whatever bit of information you have, no matter how small, for future missions. Of course, it's also possible we might not be able to use it. Well, yeah. Um, that's why some information is useless, right? Definition of useless. Okay. Let's we need a way through. get moving. Let's look around for a route we can take. So do you think that these uh, androids take breaks? <laughs> because I feel like the way our first playthrough went, they're never going to hook up. 9S nine, nine and 2B. Um, they're basically not meant to be. Um... <laughs> It would be nice to see them hook up at some point, though, to be honest. Uh, so it does sadden me that that might not be the case. There is a chest here. Yes! Minimap to the rescue. All right. Well, that wasn't too bad. I was so used to these uh, tattered pamphlet. Oh, this, hey. is... this is data from the old world. What? Data from the old world? Where is this intel? Archives. Old World Information Tattered Pamphlet. Arc Information Carnival Plaza. Pass through the gates and step into a world of fantasy before enjoying a fabulous parade put on by our carnival cast. Parades are held twice daily at 2 p.m. and 6 p.m. Midnight Town. How many of the ghosts that stalk these back streets can you track down? Roller coasters soar through the air over at over 130 kilometers an hour. Wow. In this wildly popular attraction. Grand Ferris Wheel. Perfect for those looking to wind down after a day of hard play. Rumor has it that if you see fireworks while riding the Ferris wheel with someone you like, the two of you will begin dating. Um, can we please do that with TB? Would be nice. A Hollywood coaster. This dynamic thrill ride takes guests on a wild trip around a spectacular fantasy castle. It's the first roller coaster ever created with no seat belts. Sounds like a great idea. Is this why you shut down? Fantasy Castle. Treat yourself to a grand ball attended by princesses from across the entire amusement park. Admission extra. Food court. Uh, tempt your taste buds with a host of restaurants that feature something for the whole family. And remember, no trip is complete without a visit to our world-famous hot dog museum, which boasts the largest collection of wieners anywhere in the world. Using the word wieners just always sounds hilarious to me. I don't know. Do I? Am I still like a, a child on the inside that I find it funny? It is funny, though. Like, let's be honest. <laughs> okay, uh, let's climb this thing in the way we're meant to. Because th this is totally how it was designed. <laughs> I can't wait for the roller coaster ride, guys. It'll be really exciting. I remember when we first came here, 
uh, and fought the robot in charge of this place. But I was still using a mouse and keyboard and I was still really bad at this game. So it'll be really refreshing to see how things have changed and uh, how much, if at all, I've gotten better. I, I mean, obviously I've gotten better, but you know. Uh, it was a tough fight, I remember that. And my Because I was on keyboard, my baby finger was very sore. So this bad guy has not changed at all. <sighs> These machines are heavily armed. We'll regret it later if we let them escape. So let's take them out. Or we could just let him go. I mean, I know they're kind of shooting in our direction, but I will let you in on a secret. We're going to liberate them shortly. Unless you're saying we have to fight them. Is that what you're implying? Because it seems like they're going in a circle, so maybe that is the case. Seems like it might be. Is he just driving in a circle? It seems like we might not even have to fight this guy. Uh, we will let him live then. Because... Uh, we fought him last time because we felt we needed to. But I feel kind of heartless to fight them now. They're harmless completely. I mean, they might hurt us with their balloons, but... Just don't touch him! To be, please. I don't need to interfere in again. Hey, we got a chest here. This is exactly what we wanted. Yes. Well, seriously, there needs to be a way to dodge in these hacking games. Filthy lottery ticket. All right, let's have a look at the lottery ticket. Not that uh, there'll be anything useful there for us. Better luck next time. Wow. Heartless. Heartless. Really heartless. <laughs> Okay, let's head on upstairs. Leaving those guys there. Uh, we won't we won't regret it because we will liberate them. So only good things. Only good things. Uh, there is a player's body there that we're gonna want to <laughs> loot. A cursed child saw squad mates lose their minds in a city reclaimed by nature. Analysis. It is a device that propels humans on rails at high speeds for the purposes of amusement. It we... was commonly referred to as a roller coaster. Yes, I was going to say that's what we call it. Sure are strange creatures. All right, let's see. I know that some robots pop up while we're doing this machines, but um, let's see if they actually attack us. Nines. Oh, they are actually gonna battle us, okay. At some point, we will get her to call us nines. We will absolutely get her to call us nines. I have no doubt of that. Whoopsie daisy. Gotta keep an eye on the enemies around me. Might actually be worth uh, changing pods at this point. Okay. That's how we got here last time. Alert. Jumped Multiple off early. Resistance members detected beneath this room. Uh, I don't remember rescuing them last time, but I guess these things happen. Oh, we're just dropping down. Let's do it. Oh, yeah, that's how we got into the arena. Okay. It makes sense now. It's a lot of sense. She is still so creepy. I'm not prepared for this. The music is the best though in this fight. What the hell? 
Our records don't say anything about a machine like this. And she's level 39 now. Come on, this is gonna be tough, guys. We're level 36. She's gonna be really hard. Oh, we can't even hack her. Wow. If we can't hack her, how are we supposed to do this? Woo! Oh! Oops! Okay. <laughs> this is so much better on a controller. I remember how hard this was the first time. It's tough dodging this stuff. Oh! She's really going for it. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna have to jump over these now. That was how you do it. Oh! Okay. We can't hurt her anymore. Because she's probably gonna start the next boss stage. Oh! Ah! Didn't we have to do this with 9L? With 2B last time? Interesting. Is that her on the right? Guys, she just wanted to be pretty. Wow. If we take hacking damage, it'll affect our bodies as well. Uh, that is typically how these things work. Toby. Oh man, I feel so bad for her now that I know why she did what she did. Those are your her units we came here to rescue. So she stole all their clothes and made her own. Being attacked with dead androids. Wait, I don't think. Two B. I'm detecting black box signals. They are dead. They've been turned into weapons. All right, this ends now. So we have to uh, take them all out. Essentially, is what you're saying. Why have I lost control of the camera? <laughs> oh yeah, it's because. We have to dodge attacks now. I forgot this. I've almost analyzed the enemy okay. hacking pattern. I'm going to try to hack it back. Keep it busy. You got it. Let's do it. Now I just can't get hurt. That's oh great. And I drive right into the wall. That was obviously a bad idea. Oh. Yeah, I am totally not gonna survive this. <laughs> Woo! I knew that was gonna happen. You just, it's impossible. It's so hard. Okay, try again. Okay, uh, the advice I received online was to fire in the general direction of uh, the, <laughs> the bullets and just focus on dodging. Oh man, she's literally trying to impress this other machine. She's literally just trying to impress this other robot. Guys, I'm not ready for this. It's too much for me today. Okay, uh... Oh, no, no, that ain't good. That is not good. Oops. Okay, let's hack her again. <laughs> I love those bouncing balls. That is really cool. Oh, goodness. Okay, we just have to ah, stay between the bullets. <laughs> Woo. That is tough. That is tough. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, take out all of the androids in the vicinity. Okay, hack her quickly before she hits us. Oh. Oopsie daisy, getting a bit too close for my comfort. <laughs> Whoa, I forgot this was a thing. Was this actually a thing? That is terrifying. Okay, I, I want to deal with these guys. Oh! We actually managed to get her? That's so bad for her. Look at me. Oh, please. Look at me. Uh, I want your eyes to look upon me alone. I feel so bad for her. Was this like her last message to us? Or to the other one she was talking to? Have I not become beautiful? You became like a really, really twisted version of yourself. You definitely lost whatever beauty you had. I mean... We're more... It's really what matters is what, what we are like inside, but... You know. Do these clothes make me look cute? Uh, not particularly. If you like it if I walk like this. Isn't this a song? I still don't understand what it means to love someone. But I've made up my mind. I will do whatever it takes to capture his affection. Long ago, an old machine life form told me something. Beauty is what wins love. But what is beauty? After researching the old world, I finally learned the truth. Beauty is pretty skin. Beauty is stylish accessories. Beauty is looking one's best. I will become beautiful. I will do it for him. I once heard tell of a precious jewel far to the east. It was said to be located on a terribly dangerous mountain. But I did not care. I slipped on cliffs. I fell onto rocks. But eventually, I claimed the jewel. Blue stone. Brilliant blue. So beautiful. I lost many parts obtaining this jewel. I lost myself. Oh, but my wounds are badges. There's a rumor floating among the other machine life forms lately. <laughs> Devour the body of an android to gain eternal beauty. Such nonsense. It's physically impossible to obtain beauty by consuming an android. But I tried anyway. I would try anything. Wow. That is sad. Her entire story is coming out now. Wanted to vomit. But I kept going. She even did it when she felt, like, repulsed by it. It tasted like oil. Well, yes, it's a machine. <laughs> Not a moment passed where I didn't strive to become more beautiful. But he still won't look my way. Is this Jean-Paul? Is this Jean-Paul? I feel like it's Jean-Paul. I even tried to learn what is called a song. Songs can make someone have feelings for you. That's what they say. So I practiced every day. But he still won't look my way. Well, that's a song. I ate more androids. I even ate machine life forms. But he still won't look my way. This is such a sad story, guys. He won't look my way. 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 Ah, oh, just repeating this into oblivion. Man, girl, I feel so bad for you. Won't look my way. 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 
Oh, girl. This is why we don't get caught in such things, right? This is why um, we try try not to buy into society's definitions of what what gives your life value. You decide what is valuable in your life, not someone else. And if someone doesn't want to look your way, well, maybe, maybe it's because they are so absorbed in their own life that they can't see the beauty in others. And I know I'm waxing lyrical right now, but legit. Don't, don't buy into this stuff, please. And if any of you are feeling this way, I'm sorry. Shouldn't be a thing that people go through, but I know that many people do struggle with body image issues. Yeah. That's when I realized he cares not for jewels, or songs, or beauty, or appearance, or anything else. He cannot win his love. This is Jean-Paul telling you now. Why have I done this? myself exactly this is the point i'm trying to get to here i mean like no don't blame yourself okay the, w the worst thing you can do is now get guilty okay that's even worse because then you're just first you were attacking yourself by trying to look good for someone then you end up attacking yourself by um blaming yourself for ha feeling the things you feel don't do that meaningless is that what broke her like she just short-circuited because of it, I gaze into the mirror. In its reflection, I see only my own meaninglessness. Meaninglessness? And so I scream. Someone, please look my way. Guys, I did not expect this to turn into something so heartbreaking. Oh, guys. I thought she was like... So one-dimensional when we first fought her, and now she's... I feel so sorry for her. And so sad that it came to what it came to. I wish we could have saved her. Helped her, like, uh, rehabilitate and heal. All that good stuff. Kick his ass! Jean-Paul deserves to rotten hell. <laughs> He's a machine, so I can say those things. It's okay. <laughs> I'm surprised 9S did not oh, say anything to TV. No worries. Yeah, I'll just like had to live this a really traumatic memory. Okay. Uh, yeah. I mean, we have to save those androids. The only um. The only consequence of having to do what I had to do was I had to live through the trauma of I'm sorry to be there so of, of finding out about I her story. That's so sad. Alive by that enemy. Oh. Well, now we are gonna find uh we need to retrieve these bodies whenever we encounter them because we get stuff out of it. I don't know why I wasn't doing that. You see you get uh, but it's only a small amount of money, it's not a lot. I don't know if it's actually worth it, but <laughs> hey, on the off chance it is, might as well. Uh, okay, uh, I suspect that we might just find that tank wandering around now. Wow, <laughs> it was dark. Okay. So, um, what is it? That machine had some pretty weird things to say, huh? It's almost like it had actual emotion. The machine. Oh, this is feelings. where that, that conversation yourself. comes from. Yeah, I guess. Wow. Oh, these things take on such new meanings. I legit thought he was just being dramatic. I, I couldn't understand why he was so perturbed by it. I mean, I, I, I did feel bad about the way things were, but I did not feel as perturbed as he feels. So now it makes so much sense. True, that one came straight for us. 10,000 gold. Well, uh, could be useful one day if we find something to buy with it. Maybe, uh, maybe... Maybe we'll find that special trader in the city center. 
And we'll be able to buy something useful there. Yep, here's the white flag of surrender. This thing is awfully verbose for a machine. Yeah, go straight there. No reason not to. Still, we should at least head over there and gather data, right? Uh, I know where you're gonna take us. Oh, over to the right? That's how we get there? Okay, I totally forgot that. This way. This way. Guys, I want to just quickly check if the tank is still there. Let, let's just check that quickly, because it's really curious little detail. Uh, and then we will head from there, I think. Uh, to the village. <laughs> Where, um... Pascal is our new, our soon-to-be new friend. If he's still wandering around here, then I'll be really great. Oh no! Yes, look at that! Look at that! It pays to be kind. Look at him! Can can he actually still hurt us with these things? No, they're just balloons. They literally can't hurt you. Yeah. There was literally no reason to attack this guy last time. We just ended up attacking him because we could. Well, there we go. All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, let's leave it there uh, for this week on the Automata. Um, we're still probably going to have one more week of just one episode. I believe that'll be next week. And then hopefully jumping back into two episodes a week. Uh, and making some faster progress. Especially because I want to start uh, completing all the side quests that we weren't able to do last time. Because we dove straight ahead with the story, which is totally worth it. But uh, we are much more powerful now, and so these side quests should be easier. So uh, yeah, we'll leave it there. And I'll see you guys next time on Neo Automata. Bye for now.